Hey, I'm Jeff. And I'm Phil, and we're the Cocktail Dudes. Today we're going to make the Artichoke Alexander. <laughs> this is our crazy take on the classic Alexander, mm -hmm. right? Yep. In the vein of the Frenet Alexander, right, where we're replacing the primary spirit, which originally would have been gin, mm -hmm. more commonly you see brandy, yep, especially in Wisconsin, with this artichoke amaro, yeah, right. Chinar's made with artichokes, and this actually gives you a, a creamy, bitter backbone uh, with some coffee and cocoa notes to it. Yeah, this is a delicious cocktail. Mm -hmm. You don't taste artichoke when you taste chinar. No, you don't. But it's in there, yeah. kind of as an advertising gimmick, I always thought. <laughs> they got it right on the front of the bottle there. <laughs> but it's delightful. Mm -hmm. The creme de cocoa gives it a nice added sweetness uh, and some chocolate notes. And of course the richness comes from, from that heavy cream. Mm -hmm. All right, let's begin. We're gonna throw Let's everything right into our cocktail shaker. Starting with one and a half ounces of the chinar. One and a half ounces of creme de coco, chocolate liqueur. We're using the Tempest Fugit brand, which is our favorite. If you want to make your own, you can check out our video on that. Yeah. Homemade creme de coco. Not rocket science, is it, Phil? No. If it was too difficult, we wouldn't do it. And an ounce and a half of heavy cream. Then once you make your creme de coco, then you can try all of these different Alexanders that we are making today, so. Yeah. Mm -hmm. It won't go to waste. No, definitely <laughs> not. All right, we're gonna shake this with some ice. I'm gonna work on the garnish here. <sighs> so we're gonna double strain that in our glass. That's gonna keep out some of the ice chunks that may come through. This is a delicious cocktail. Notes of coffee suddenly appear mm -hmm. in this cocktail, which you don't get from the Chinar independently or the uh, chocolate liqueur. I've taken some artichoke leaves and kind of fanned them out and we'll use that as our garnish here. You can also just float some cocoa nibs on top. But here you have your delicious Delightful Artichoke Alexander. Enjoy. Cheers.